in this video we're going to talk about some texturing with the help of UEW Unwrap. So let's get it started. First of all I have a 3D Studio Max and I'm going to take the box and I will draw the box from my top viewport. Don't think about the measurement I'm just going to focusing on the size because I'm going to create a toothpaste. A box of a toothpaste. So I think this was good and a little bit scale up like this perfectly done and uh, and now just adjust their size so what am i going to do i have this is the packaging you can call it toothpaste packaging or colgate packaging which i have already downloaded from the google so i'm going to take the video material first and i will assign the material here and then i'm going to call this one okay so as you can see it has the look uh, like this we will try to adjust with the help of uvw map and i'm going to take the box and we'll just increase the size of length width and height of this texture just like this so you can see it looks cool but this part as well so we can adjust <laughs> but still we have a problem about their left and right side so this idea is totally fail. So now I'm going to UVW unwrap. And here I'm going to go to the UV editor and I will open the UV editor first and then map and make a flattened map. So every side of the box is going to be a flattened. That means that every side open each side open will separately each side will open separately so here all my six side I'm gonna scale down them and here it is so let me show you which side is this one okay this is my top this is my side this is my downside and that was my left side so we just need to align them doesn't matter you will align or not but I will align them I will take all the thick side on the one side like this and all the thin side on the top okay we'll create them that was it okay and also this one So now uh, what am I going to do? I'm going to go to the tools, render UV template and make a UVW template. I will save this template on my desktop. It's called uh, packaging with PNG format. Right. So let's go to the Adobe Photoshop to create my texture. So I'm going to go to the Adobe Photoshop here and will open my UVW unwrap snap so here it is my packaging I'm going to take single layer and assign blue color so I can see the wire green wireframes in it and now I'm going to open my texture it's a toothpaste called Lashkara I don't know what is it and it's not a sponsored as well I'm just going to take marquee tool and uh, I will draw a marquee like this selection and go to the edit first and make a copy come here and make a paste here it is and placed it on my this wall and it doesn't matter if you stretch stretch that texture it doesn't matter it will not stretch in the real 3d form so i think that is good we have to place properly like this all right okay so go back to the texture here it is and i'm going to take another again marquee tool and we'll draw this one the same procedure you will have to copy them and paste them and Press Ctrl T for the transformation and 
adjust this one here like this okay uh, so we have completed this two texture here and now I'm gonna take marquee tool and just select make a selection of uh, this part okay control C and control V by copy and paste and a control T for the transformation and adjust the structure according to their wireframe okay so the last one same thing I'm gonna do this like this okay so we just need to copy I'm sorry again I'm gonna do this like this okay control C and control V or paste here and uh, now hold control T and adjust this texture I'm gonna delete this extra part delete them and then control T and adjust the texture like this so here uh, we have done our top bottom and left right but uh, uh, the side of your start okay we need to adjust as well hit perfect okay so these are the sides the top sides I mean the open opening gate of the toothpaste so we just need to adjust this okay I don't think so like I'm gonna copy them again I'm gonna make a selection after making the selection make a control C and then control V here and we'll rotate them by holding transformation control T and adjust Okay, again you will have to take the duplicates. And now as you can see that I have these textures perfectly done. I'm gonna save them as a copy and I will save. Now we'll go back to the 3D Studio Max and I'm gonna go to the material editor first and I will replace the texture. We'll replace the texture like this, packaging and assign. So now you can see this texture is perfectly aligned on the toothpaste box. So we can see everyone, everything is aligned straight. This one, this one. Okay, so this this is flip. We need to rotate them because the Lashkara text is on other side. So I'm gonna go to the pick texture bitmap and call my texture here so now I can see my texture here I'm going to select my texture and rotate so now the texture is aligned on the same sequence okay it's also aligned but we need to rotate first like this and that one will be opposite this okay so what am i going to do i'm just i have this texture toothpaste box with the uvw unwrap or unwrap uvw okay so i'm gonna call my studio light setup in it you can get the link in the description uh, okay so i'm gonna call everything except my sphere because it is sphere is object in it that's that's why so here is my texture you can get the link in the description the tutorial of this studio light setup so i'm just going to adjust my toothpaste here the lashkara toothpaste okay so take the vertex and i will increase the size of my back plate uh, 
and I will rotate my toothpaste like uh, this and suppose this one like in a different direction because I'm just going to take out some photogenic render uh, of this toothpaste okay and I will take duplicate by holding shift key and now I'll rotate like this this and yes this gonna take rotate tool make local so we can adjust this texture that is perfectly done okay so I'm gonna take my vertices another side and we'll take more over there and take the high quality so we can adjust some lights here as well like this and uh, I'll take my lights perfectly shadows with it just in decrease the amount of light is 35% and now this one has to be 40 to 35% okay so a little bit um, okay we need to take more rotation yes we need to show another side of the texture same that's done and I'm going to take the render let's see how it looks like there you go the beautiful render of this toothpaste with the help of uh, unwrap UW. I hope you like this tutorial if you like this to so subscribe my channel press the bell icon thank you so much